Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Last week I did a quick video on Hasbro's first NFT tied to their Power Rangers property. Today the NFT pack that was delivered last week is now available to open and I just wanted to share the process with everyone. But before I go through that, I wanted to go over some concerns about NFTs I had in the comment section of my last video about NFTs. Now, just a bit of background. Personally, I have been in the blockchain space since 2013, and my prior YouTube channel was actually focused on blockchain education. Now, when folks hear the word blockchain, Bitcoin is probably the first thing that comes to mind with Ethereum second. While Bitcoin is a blockchain that uses a lot of energy to operate, and to some extent Ethereum as well, although that is currently changing, not all blockchains have the same mechanics to operate. For example, Bitcoin uses the very energy intensive method called mining and Ethereum, while it still uses mining, is actually moving to a more energy efficient method called proof of stake. Think of blockchain like a car. It functions to transport people and things around, but not all cars run the same way. You have cars that run on gas, diesel, electric, and even hydrogen powered cars. Now, depending on what that car runs on, the environmental impact will be different. Now, using the analogy of the car, you can see that all blockchains do not have the same environmental impact. Which brings us to the Worldwide Asset Exchange, also known as WAX. Now, WAX is a blockchain Hasbro has selected to launch their NFTs. Other companies like Tops, Capcom, Major League Baseball and Atari have launched NFTs on this blockchain, with Mattel to have their first NFT launch on WAX as well. I believe the reason why these companies chose WAX is because it uses a lot less uh, energy and is actually certified carbon neutral, which is something that you don't hear about for a lot of the larger, more popular blockchains. If you want to learn more about the WAX blockchain, I will have a link to some articles in the description below where you can check it out for yourself. Now, if you think digital collectibles are silly, that's fine. It's not for everyone. I mainly bought this one because it was tied to a physical asset, which is the special edition Megazord. While most of the hype around NFTs are centered around collectibles and gaming, there are some real world problems NFTs can solve when paired with physical goods, but that is probably a discussion left to another channel. With that being said, on to opening my Megazord pack. Let me load the site and log in with my Wax wallet. Select the Dinosaur pack and then click open. Very cool animation. And there you go. Let's view it in my wallet. You can see some details of the digital card and its card ID. As you can see, the next phase in this journey takes place when there's an airdrop for a Megazord token which can be redeemed for a physical special edition Megazord. Anyway, that is it for this video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below and thanks for watching.